Good morning, sisters, brothers, friends, and family. Are y'all getting tired of me saying that? <laughs> anyway, it is a beautiful day in the neighborhood. <laughs> okay, sorry. Let, let's get real. Okay, I just I, I just want to share with y'all how excited I am for the body and bride of Christ right now, and just for the new levels of freedom. I gotta be quiet. I'm at work. But um, this new season that I personally am in, and uh, a lot of my sisters and brothers, and one of the keys, you know, here's a key. The key to your breakthrough is truth. Facing the truth. Not having a, uh, a mentality of a principality. Not being a victim, but being victorious through the name, blood, and authority of Jesus Christ. The thief came to steal, kill, and destroy, but Jesus said, I have come to give you life, to give you abundant life, overcoming life. And to be victorious and to overcome, it's first you have to face the truth about your own life. You have to look in the mirror and face the truth. Whatever you're going through in your life, whatever you're, you you ask the Lord, you know, if you don't know the strongholds in your life, if you don't know your blind spots, it's funny that people who are deceived, they're the last person to know that they're in deception. <laughs> Can I get a witness? So, you know, you ask the Lord the truth what, and say, Lord, what are my strongholds? If you don't know, if you know what your strongholds are, then just ask the Lord, you know, Lord, how, what is the truth? How did this stronghold get entrenched? Do I need, you know, you can break generational curses all you want. You can plead the blood all you want. But until you personally take responsibility, come out of agreement with whatever it is that you're doing or going through, facing the truth, put, up, put on your big girl panties, your big boy panties, underoos, whatever you need to put on, and just say, okay, Lord, get in the trenches with Holy Spirit and say, that's it. This is my day of freedom. Pull the veil of lies, seduction, deception. You know, wherever you're deceived, ask the Lord. Lord, expose every lie. Pull back every veil of uh, deception. Whatever lie I'm believing, whatever it is that has, you know, that sh however that stronghold has been entrenched in your life, as soon as you find out the truth, Jesus said, you will know the truth, who is Jesus. And he said, I'll make you free. But if you don't know the truth and you don't face it and you don't come out of agreement with whatever it is that's dark and ugly that you're not, that you're ashamed of, that you wish you didn't do, especially anything that you're trying to hide, you know, obviously you're not supposed to be doing it. You're not supposed to be thinking it, you know, whatever it is. So you just face that truth, whatever it is. And uh, Jesus is, he'll, he'll break you free, but you have to face the truth. So anyway, it's all about, um, you know, deliverance and inner healing go together. As soon as you face the truth and as soon as you get to the root, you can uh, uproot that thing, bind the strong man, and plunder his house. So anyway, I love you today, and uh, I, I hope that you're just excited about getting your breakthrough in healing and deliverance as I am. <laughs> you know, a slave who loves their chains can never be free. You gotta hate your chains until you hate your darkness, until you hate your bondage. You know, Jesus, he became our sin. He forgives us of our sins. Our sins are under the blood, but they do open the door and give the enemy legal ground. So if you're being tormented and you're being harassed by the enemy, check your life and uh, tear down those strongholds one by one. Lay the ax to those roots, uproot those uh, lay the axe to every root in your life. Get your inner healing so you can get your deliverance and get your lasting breakthrough. Pull down those strongholds and um, 
I guess I covered everything, but I love you today. And uh, 10.30 tomorrow morning, White Dove Fellowship. If you wake up tomorrow and you're like, you know what? I think I need a breakthrough. 3600 Manhattan Boulevard. Hope to see you there. Love you. Uh, stay tuned for the next nugget. Peace in. That surpasses all understanding. Bye-bye.